I'm Vicky Taylor here at Gallery 78 in front of the women artist Stephen May on Friday, October 29th at his opening, The Kitchen Sink and Other Miracles. So, Stephen, this painting, we had a lot of different um, reactions to it. Some people were found it kind of hilarious, but some people were really surprised by it. And we also know that uh, Francis Bacon did a similar piece like this. So, would you mind telling us a bit about this painting? This particular painting? Yeah. Well, there, it's really, in my mind, it's really no different from any other ones. I do it, I, I did it for the same reason, basically, that I do all the paintings, and I'm trying to, I'm trying to do basically the same thing in this painting as all of them, and I'm, I'm, I think I would say that I'm sort of trying to feel what it's like to be a human being. It's basically what I would do in my paintings, um, and not not sort of see, uh, to see what we are as clearly as I can and see our, the human condition to see what it's, you know, what it's like. Um, and not to puff us up into something bigger than we are, but not to sort of degrade us into something less than we are. And I mean, it, the whole, everywhere you look around, every, everything you look at, it's, it's like, a, it's, like a, a, um, it's like a magic show, you know, that it's just how did this happen? How is there something, how is, why is there something rather than nothing in this world? Um, and so everything is like a small miracle. So every, all the paintings, whether it's this one or any of them, are all sort of do, doing the same thing. But some of the paintings have a little idea behind them, a reason why they are, why I painted that and not that, and this and that, not the other. Uh, and this just happens to be a painting that does have a little bit of a story. And it has to do with this gallery here, actually. I was in here, uh, sometime in the last year, I just dropped in to say hello, and I needed to go to the bathroom. So I went upstairs to the second floor bathroom, and if you go into the bathroom here, you'll see that there's art all over the walls. Mm -hmm. But I was in the bathroom, sitting down in the toilet with the door closed, obviously, and there right in front of you is a door with no art on it. And I thought, this, there has to be something on this door. You have to put, there needs to be art there, because it's what you're looking at when you're using the bathroom. And, I, and so I thought for a little while, what would be, what would be a good painting to go on there? I wanted to paint a painting that you could put on there. And I thought, well, it's just, somebody on the bathroom, so I'm using the toilet would be the best thing to have there. Um, so that's, I decided I was going to do that, and then I started thinking, who could I get to pose for it? And I thought that would be really awkward, somebody posed for me sitting on the toilet, I didn't think anybody would want to do that, so I thought the only way I could do it was to do it myself, so I did it myself. So I suppose it's after the show, if nobody buys it, I don't think anybody's going to buy it. <laughs> I'm hoping that they'll come in the bathroom upstairs and people will sit on the toilet and sort of see, see themselves in the world. They'll see, yeah. That's a good story. Yeah. So Thank that's you. what I think. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs>